and welcome back here to our blind first playthrough of God of War Ragnarok. And oh my gosh, we uh, we took out the gravel belly last time. Nuts. Uh, yeah, it was a good time. I love how I just banged my head against it. I should have probably switched out some of my equipment or just like tailored myself to that battle. But I got through it. Uh, it felt very Dark Souls-esque to me and uh, we are moving on from here. The only thing I noticed and I noticed right now, our health is still way down. Um, how do I get that up? So, I wish there was... Let's check our map here. By the way, we we have... Okay, so we have this portal, this Idrisil Rift. Whatever came out of it one-shotted me last time, but I was also close to death. So I feel like I could try that portal again. But then again, I haven't done any of those portals. So, um, <laughs> maybe, maybe we'll just move on real quick and come back at it later. Because we're going to have to do some... Um, some backtracking at some point once we have access to other places. So we're headed into, I guess, this, uh, the Elven Sanctum. Let's do it. Can't think of anything else I'm supposed to do yet. I could use some health, but I think maybe we can find that along the way. I'm not ready to, uh, <laughs> jump in at that uh, portal again without full health, so. And I might as well hit these things. Oh, and what was it last time, too? That damn uh, phantom over here. That was tough, but if we run into another one of those, at least I understand how to do it now. Once I understood the game mechanic, it really wasn't as difficult as I was making it. Um, yeah, so. What do we got? Oh, jeez. Oh my god. Have I mentioned how good this game looks? Oh, those wings. You know what? That reminds me of... Um, it was like a puppet with mechanical wings that I had in the 80s and 90s as a toy. I forget what that was. Oh, I had so many good toys in the 80s, 90s, guys. I'm dating myself, but I don't mind doing that. That's part of the deal here. All right, so... Let's uh, remember how to play. Make sure we're recording. Do I have a camera? Check, check. Is this thing on? Is this a poem? No, no, it's a... Uh, it's a six. Jewelry. Oh? Put it on one of my horns. Let's see if I can pull it off. No. Weirdo. A uh, bracelet that is six of six. A rather lovely piece of jewelry crafted by one of Freyr's Light Elf supporters. It seems to be a bracelet hand-formed to fit Freyr's wrist, which introduces the question, why was it discarded? Was Freyr so inundated with gifts and jewelry that he simply couldn't find a place for it? Or did he perhaps wear it for a time only to cast it off, possibly in anger or shame or some combination of the two, once he sped back to Vanaheim to stop Freyr's wedding? Man, we're getting the time frame on here. And after what we went through with, um, in Vanaheim. That's all my brother's tributes. That is. Do you prefer we hang on to them? Do what you will. If Freyr didn't bother taking them when he left Alfheim, he wouldn't mind us selling them to the dwarves. Well, that's what we're going to do. But I also wouldn't mind talking to Freyr again sometime. I just wasn't uh, prepared to spend more time in Alfheim. Because we have to go back there once again, too. So, at some <laughs> point, right? Search for clues about elven history. The whole last episode, I came here for this mission. But we had to, like, knock stuff out first, and I was su happily surprised about all the other stuff. And I love being able to pause it and sneeze just insanely for, like, five seconds. And then come back and be like, hi, how you doing? <laughs> An elven library? An archive of knowledge! No sign of the Light Elves. For now. Maybe <laughs> they've left for the day, and we can browse at our leisure. That is not going to happen, is it? What we need, though, is some damn health, but we'll see what happens. Oh, also, wait, hold on a second here. Are we missing... Oh, it's so pretty here. You know what? I have to run. Um, We're going to go back to uh, Brock, and I think we have to pick up a stone. A resurrection stone, right? That's what I'm forgetting here. So, uh, I will meet you right back here in however long it takes me. Okay, we're back in here now. I uh, No conversations, nothing going on. I literally just went and picked up a resurrection stone so that we'd have it. This place is beautiful. 
But I mean, this whole game is beautiful. So what do we got? Lore or a poem? The examination of temporal significance. This evening... What? This evening I find myself musing on the scent of a book. When the paper is fresh, it carries the gentle notes of the plants it came from, light, floral, with a touch of sweetness. As time passes, the pages age. They take on their brittle tan. A tear forms from any force stronger than the softest of touches. The scent hardens, crisp at the beginning, moving into the earth, earthy musk left behind from dust, desert air, and insect feasts. To these ephemera, nearly as impermanent as ourselves, do we entrust the collective knowledge of our elven histories. Is this venture foolish? I concede the fleeting nature of existence, be it of flesh or scroll, yet I would not trade the pleasure of putting ink to page for all the treasures of Alfheim, the consul. Uh, I used to manage at a bookstore and handle lots of used books coming in and have to make the purchases and all that sort of stuff. And it's, yeah, handling a book uh, that's aged... It's really interesting stuff. I mean, long as it doesn't have cat pee and uh, bugs all over it and stuff like that. Mold, must. <laughs> all that good stuff comes with it, too, but... So, these are the Valin schematics, eh? You know of him. Aye. One of the most gifted... I gotta find out what that is. These pages are very old, could be anywhere. It's likely the relics outlined in these diagrams are very powerful. Long forgotten sword hilts. Okay. Dwarven smiths around, until he developed a conscience, anyhow. Sometimes it can be really hard to find those in my inventory if I don't know what type of um, item we picked up. I've spent like three minutes scrolling through everything to do it, so I'm more likely to kind of hit right then and then finish up the conversation after we find out if there's some reading. What do we got here? Grunt. Er. Mm. That's, that's what he did. I'm on it. <laughs> Uh, rules of the Sanctum. All visitors must observe strict silence Oh, inside the library, even in the vestibule passageway, grand hall, mezzanine, and upper circle. No books are to leave the premises for any reason under penalty of death. Transcriptions of any material within the library are expressly forbidden. Damage to library materials due to carelessness, including creases, folds, annotations, and such like, even accidental, will not be tolerated. Comstables, libations, and liquids of any kind are forbidden. Visitors must check in with the present librarian before leaving the library. Failure to adhere to the rules will result in immediate punishment to be determined by the present librarian. Oh, are we going to have to fight a librarian? That's the librarian. I love it. I'd add, though, if everything is fragile, impermanent, and it's all going to fall apart, shouldn't somebody do some sort of... Uh, copying of these things at some point just so that they don't we don't lose them you know i don't know transcriptions and things all right these texts alone are not enough to end the elven war but restricting their access only serves those who wish to prolong it taking a page out of odin's book aye quite the advantage for the light elves yep restricting knowledge what we need is a printing press, right? Anybody? You guys know what I'm talking about. Because people who watch this are generally smart. Forgotten Tower started. Oh, a treasure map. Okay. Uh, Let's see here. Forgotten Tower. There are those who built this tower who gave everything they had to complete it, and where did it put them? In the ground. I was almost one of them. Never again. I leave this treasure in the hopes that whoever needs it may find it, and in so doing is reminded of their own worth. No tower, no matter how great, is worth one's life. Is that the door? We'll see it when we head out, right? Forgotten Tower. Gotta remember there's a treasure. Hopefully we can just look outside and be like, oh, there it is. Okay. Jewel of Idrisil, a piece of the broken amulet of Idrisil. It can be used to allow the amulet to hold additional enchantments. I think we have to go, like, repair the amulet with it, correct? Oh, one moment here. That feels kind of like a big deal. 
Stone wood. Anything else? Oh, yeah, thank you. All this knowledge of their ancestors, their shared history, poetry, just sitting here. The arbiters of knowledge. We are the caretakers of truth. Uh, the arbiters of knowledge, protectors of this repository of enlightenment that stretches back to our earliest writings, ancient as the sands. It is our sacred duty to protect our elven learnings and prevent the possible spread of it to those who cannot reconcile the wisdom found within these walls. The benighted masses cannot be trusted, cannot be expected to assimilate these truths. They lack the intellectual fortitude to absorb and accept the divisive nature of certain revelations. You know, some of this is true, but that holding back and reserving it isn't going to enlighten anyone. Uh, this suppression is not cruelty, nor does, is it an attempt to control. It is mercy, pure and simple. Never forget that, says the arbiter. You know, I mean, the masses can be stupid and mean. I mean, just look up those quotes about, about it, and you'll, you know, God. George Carlin, philosophers. What a waste. <laughs> Um, so they're not completely incorrect, but I don't know. Craziness. Like right now they're talking about, in, in reality, uh, the Rosetta Stone. You know, in Egypt's like, bring it back to us. You know what? It is theirs, and it should go back to them. Um, like, screw imperialism. They're like, oh, we're, we're daddy here, and we're going to take it. But, I like, there's it's, it's tough, like, right now going on in... Uh, Afghanistan and all that, the, the Taliban has destroyed so many, so many, so many uh, amazing artifacts and relics just to keep their knowledge, that knowledge away from others and that ours is the true way. So to say that there shouldn't be people that are preserving things is wrong, but at the same time, who, who made you, you know, daddy and put you in charge? It's a bunch of bullshit. So I'm just, there's, where's the line and who's, who's right, who's wrong? How should it go? I don't have the answers, but I love the argument and the debate. That they're kind of presenting here too. Hmm. Consul's journal. This book is sealed, but there is an inscription. The consul. Big Veer spoke of an exile of the same name. Odds are he'd like a gander at that particular text. So where are we going for this? Leave the sanctum. We're going to have a librarian coming after us to kill us. Because we're taking books out of the sanctum. That's my opinion. I'm sticking to it. Let's see. I'm scared. I'm scared, guys. I'm always scared. Makes it fun, though. feel like we're going to cross the doorway here and there's going to be something not fun waiting for us. Look Slapper. at all the... Oh. Ah, it appears the librarian would like a word. We knew that because we read. Lata Framborg. Sounds like she wants that journal back. Oh, no. shit. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh. Get this up. Oh. Oh. Let's get Oh my god. On your guard, Let's get our stuff together. This is our first fight of the day. Oh my god. Where's my damn axe? Why? I can't block that, I guess. Okay, we're gonna have to die a couple times. My god, I just I can't figure this one out for a minute. Damn. Okay, I'm waking up to this, guys. Yeah, whenever they throw that shit at me, it pisses me off. Okay, you know what? We're just going to die and we're going to restart it. The Maven. We got this. I'm just not playing well. I found something going on. That's a glitch, I think. 
We'll take it. There, we're dead. But we got closer. We'll do it. Again. Okay. I know, well, I don't know that we can do it with ourselves, so... This is heavy, man. Damn, I've hated Light Elves forever. Well, Dark Elves, Light Elves, they all suck. Darn it. Bill darn it. Shield strike. Oh, shield strike, bastard. <laughs> she thinks she's protecting them by hiding all this knowledge away. Our ally wishes to read this journal. We are taking the book. Aww. Oh, I'm so happy about that, guys. That was, oh, oh, that was good. Okay, it took us a little bit to get it. But uh, we got it <laughs> three, four times. That's that's not the worst thing. Let's uh, get our where's our axe? Oh, we can't pick it up. That'll get the blood pumping to start with. Anything else here? No. Let's let's leave. I'm impressed. Thought you were going to end her. When last we traveled here, after Faye passed, I killed an elf of great importance. The ramifications were dire for his people. I do not wish to make the same mistake twice. Aw, oh, awesome. Elven Sanctum completed. Now where do we have to go? The Maven, though. The vigilant steward of an Alfheim library. Our ally in Vanaheim, Bigvir, told me this steward comes from a long line of elves who followed the same path. Our ally in Vanaheim. Oh, we gotta go back that way. Uh, good. Yay, we get to go to Freyr's camp. A uh, library exists to hold and share knowledge. To hide this away and claim it would destroy the Light Elves from within is to lack faith in the people who would most benefit from it. I don't disagree. That's... Well, well, well. So... Let's get the hell out of here. 
Good times. Yeah, we are. We're hurt. Let's uh, let's roll. Yeah, if, if we want to do those portals, we'll have to come back for them. Um, but that's not <laughs> not my number one concern at the moment. So let's hit a portal. And do we have to go back to uh, Freyr to drop this off with Bigvir? And then we found it. That's awesome. I'm I'm happy. That was getting frustrating, but you know, it's my own play. Like, do I throw things? Do I try different stuff? Like, what do I have her set up with? I was using the stun arrows. Should I have been using different arrows? Who knows, right? You know, one thing I want to do, though. Let's go here to our... I do not like that heavy runic attack. Because it inflicts status to everybody. But I have to pull that thing back. And I keep forgetting it. Oh, that's the only one we have. Never mind. So we'll keep it. We'll keep it. I just have to remember to actually pick up the damn uh, axe afterwards. Sometimes I'll be barehanded. There might have been a way to uh, stun her more and more. I don't know. For a while there, when we were holding our shield up, it was kind of glitching out on her, but I don't. we didn't even win the fight in that one. So, what do we have here? We have uh, Eyes of Odin, Alfheim. Yeah, we want to go to Alfheim, don't we? It's Why wouldn't we turn this in? That can't be over. Here, let's go to the map. I want to go to Freyr's camp real quick. Oh, not Alfheim. Um, Vanaheim. Maybe we can't do anything with this yet. Um, we'll find out in a second. There's my door. There we go. How are we not at Freyr's camp? I guess we still have to hop on a boat to get there. That's okay. No worries. It's beautiful here. But no, we can't go in this way. It's That's the way we cannot go yet. I get it. I'll have to remember once we hit that one. Um, It's that wind stuff. Which means we should progress the story a little bit, right guys? <laughs> Instead of just doing all the side stuff. But once they presented us with some side missions, I just figured we gotta go for it. Alright. They don't make it easy to come back to him. Am I wrong? Is there a faster way back to this damn camp? Oh no, here we go. All right, everybody. Oh, puppy. Now you, sir. Can we talk to anybody? Let's talk to these elves. We found the Consul's journal. Thank you, Kratos. It is exactly what we were hoping for. The Consul risked everything to understand the mistakes of our past. And now those lessons can live on. Thank you, Kratos. The elves and we won't forget this. They aren't liable to forget all the bloodshed between them, either. There's a path towards peace for all of us. Nobody said this would be easy. After the site of my wedding, mm. face some old ghosts. There's a day I hate thinking about. Oh, your position was quite clear. No, I mean... Because it was a day I chased you away. All I wanted was for you to not go. But I was just so... angry. That day I said the dumbest stuff I've ever said. And you know how much I have to choose from. Ingvi, listen. I'm only trying to say, I closed a chapter today I thought I never could. Maybe every bit of anger and pain we can find a way to let go of is a gift we can give ourselves, you know? I'll drink to that. Awesome. Well, if I mean, if that was what this whole little run back was for, was just to have these conversations, I'm all for it. Um, you have anything new? Oh, he's just sitting here meditating. Right on, dude. How about you guys? You know what? Uh, wait, we need another stone, don't we? 
And we can turn in a couple things. I don't know. Yeah, let's go with artifacts. Oh, the console's journal. That's the actual <laughs> uh, mission here. Let's sell all. Can this lock be opened without damaging the book? The elves in Freya's camp wish to read it. Brock never met no lock he could cool. break. I'll get this sucker open and pass it along to them elves with your regards. Sounds good. We got a lot of hack silver. Let's pick up our special item. Relics, the hilt of Dainsleaf. Cool down 108 upgrades. Increase the amount of hazards. Uh, see their poison leaving. I got it. I'm going to stick, you know, I keep thinking we're going to find kind of better armor and better stuff. So I don't want to like increase myself too much, but I could at some point here, we just have to invest. Um, what do we have here? We need a resurrection stone. And just for fun, stick with that. Do we have any experience? Because I can definitely uh, spend some... Oh, we have the amulet we have to repair. There we go. Upgrade to repair socket. Now we can put another one in. Let's do that quick. Okay. Uh, I was hearing a little bit of their conversation in the background there. Let's check out our amulet. And what do we have here? We have uh, enchantment set, one of th Svartalheim enchantment set, Svartalheim enchantment set. If we wear all three, does that help us with something? Set bonus increased stun damage inflicted based on Kratos' defense. I mean, that's not bad. But Niflheim's, Niflheim's security, so we're missing a Niflheim one. Alfheim's uh, last second dodges and power Kratos' next attack. It's a bunch of interesting stuff here. Um, I'm going to go with strength and defense a little bit here. Let's put on safety. We're going to only have two if we can unlock another one. That's great, too. And what else do we have to do here? I think we need to get the hell out of... Uh, Oh, Freyr found her half dead in the jungle. She probably escaped the Blothunder breeding farm north of here. We all told him she was beyond saving. Aww. But he never gave up. She healed and hasn't left us since. She's a sweet girl. <laughs> She's pure of heart. Believes in your goodness, even if you don't. I love dogs so much. Oh, that little dog button, that little dog tail. Oh, and those little toe beans. Let's go. Let's go. It's the best part of this game. <laughs> Although, real quick, we did unlock that thing. Did they get any of this knowledge, or is that going to come later? I hope we have a chance to talk further, Mimir. Always nice to meet a fellow skull. And Kratos, I understand your homeland is famed for philosophers. When things quiet down, I'd love to hear their ideas. And your own. I have nothing to say that will interest you. Nonsense, brother. I've heard many a wise word pass those sunburned lips. <laughs> it's all right, Mimir. My wife is much the same way. Careful. Uh, quiet, but very deep. Acceptable. Whew. <laughs> she loves me so much. <laughs> okay. So I, I think we're at the end of that. We will uh, then meet you on the other end when we get back to the portal and let's hit Sindri's house. All right, everybody off the boat. Because we have we have these things over here too. We can't mess with, right? But we will eventually. This is a reunion that has been in the works for a while. Ever since she came through the door at us, or came at us as a Valkyrie, and we met our son. Um, we have the Crucible though, and we have the Eyes of Odin. Right, we are not doing those. Realm locks Sindri's house. Get the whole family. Is there something tragic happening? What's going on? Well, brother, before you see the lad again, might we discuss an approach? He will tell me where he has been. That is my approach. Ah, classic Spartan diplomacy. Wait. Did you say Odin invited him to Asgard and then he disappeared for two days? Aye. 
But surely the lad's got more sense than to- Don't underestimate Odin's powers of persuasion. He filled my son's head with lies. Why wouldn't he do the same with yours? <sighs> These two are asses, though. They're gonna come in at him like, you tell me what's going on, and da da da. Atreus ain't gonna tell you shit. And if he does, he's just gonna be like, well, to hell with you. Oh, man. Oh, oh. I just don't know. Let's see. And you tell that one eyed nut sucker he owes me one. Thank me now and eternally. Well, looky there. Glad you could make the trip, your goddessness. I put your sigil magic on the young turd's bow. But then he and Sindri got into it over something. Mm, I don't rightly know who's yelling at who in there, but I figure they both got it coming. I'm so excited, and I just can't hide it. I want to... Can we talk to this guy? I want to summon him. Here we go. Yeah! Hello! Good to see the chimes working as intended. So, who else are we likely to encounter amongst your detachable emotional apparitions? Well, there's certainly no avoiding anxiety. Oh no. Why are you talking about me? What did I do? Oh, you should have heard the shit they were talking. Savage. What? Oh dear, oh dear. There was no such talk. Shame on you, Bitter. Are you sure? Yes, Anxious. No opprobrium to be found in this discourse. I was merely making your acquaintance with our adventuring friends here. Ah! People! Well, <laughs> there it is. I love anxiety. Farewell for now, Master Kratos and Retinue. That's Talks so funny. squirrels now, huh? All day long, squirrels and dogs. By the way, this is a little, uh, that squirrel that we, we, I, it was found on the ground and washed and everything. It's very clean, but it was recovered. Let's see if we can get it there. There we go. <laughs> So that's my uh, Ratatosker. I love it. My anxiety squirrel. It's been sitting in the back there for the hey, the entire time we've had this we're channel. For you, right? Yeah, we know. We see. Let's go. Let's find out what's going on. Well, come on then. Hey, Tear! Wake up! You got company. Now, why don't you just make yourself at home in Sindri's so called study over yonder? You're sure he won't mind? Mind? He'll be thrilled. Joint's getting classier by the day. Can it be? Oh, there you are. I never thought I'd have the pleasure of seeing you again, Frigg. Uh, don't call me that. I haven't been that person in a long time. But I'm happy to see you, too. I'd feared the worst for so long, what you must have been through. Nothing so bad as what you've suffered. Freya, I am so, so sorry to hear what happened to Baldur. He was only a boy when I saw him last, but I know he meant more to you than anything. Yes. And to forbear your vengeance in this way, it's, it's truly an inspiration for those of us who believe in peace. The only peace these realms will ever know is once Odin is gone. Believe in that. So you're not here to prevent Ragnarok, you're here to bring it about. I'm here to make sure Odin doesn't hurt anyone, the way he hurt us. I can see I've upset you. Forgive me. I am far removed from my days of diplomacy. Aww. That's okay, though. They, conversations they're having. I hear them in their arguing. She's no less majestic than the last day I saw her. What a thing I must be to look at. You're amazing, Tyr. I love you. I think you're you're huge and tall and badass. That's what I like. Okay, you know what? Let's actually have a convo a little bit. Let's work Not our way too through. Not shabby having a proper goddess around the house. Try to stay on her good side this time, why don't you? Okay. Uh, I just want to see. Do, do we have anything to upgrade here necessary? We can't do the Leviathan Axe yet. We're waiting for Frozen Flame. We need a Chaos Flame. Um, we've been using this Dauntless Shield. Pack Silver and Honed Metal. A shield fit for high risk cooldown and defense. You know what? Because we're using the hell out of this thing. Doing it. I'll put some herd on them. What's up with... Isn't that the one we're wearing? A high risk, high reward parries. That's what we want. Um, 
We're using the Rond of Aggravation. High luck chance to grant a Rage Burst when parrying. These different Rons, then, is just a defense. That's just a basic one. Um, honed Metal Hack Sliver. I'm going to get that one up one. That'll mess some folks up. So the shield is like a two-part kind of thing, right? So we're still Dauntless here. We need Luminous Alloy. We still have Honed Metal for that shield. Um, I'm still going to do it. Hope you're feeling violent. Hope you're feeling violent. And I just want to see what's up and with her Lady sword here. Freya? Inflict Bifrost on enemies. Inflict Increase Stun on enemies. You know, I think... What are we at here? That's a tier one, tier one. I want to go back to her stun, I would prefer. Oh, we need the whetstone for that. We have that. So let's upgrade. The ace here will be running scared. Just kind of you looking around here. Want? Now, what grip are we actually using here? We're still using the grip of Darkdale. Stonewood and Hack Silver, and that increases our cooldown. Yeah, I mean. That's the one that came. I don't want to waste all my stuff on it. Um, but we've been using Darkdale. Let's go with it. Until I decide to go with something else. And what else can we do here? Oh, I didn't mean to back out completely. Let's go to our armor for a moment. One, We have one Asgardian ingot. And I'm a fan of that. So let's keep with that. We also have... Any of these. Healing Mist or Vanier Poison. I like the Healing Mist. I mean, the more we can stay um, healed up and ready to rock, the better. I think we're good for a moment. Let's uh, go talk to the boy. Uh, I gone. truly thought we'd seen the last of Tyr. Perhaps there really is cause for hope. Said you've been gone for days, and that's no way to watch your back. I'm hearing that a little. Let's go. But you were gone for two days with nobody to watch your back. I'm your partner. We're not supposed to keep secrets. You sound just like father. Whose side are you on? Whose side? I don't know. What does it even mean to be on your side right now? How do I know you won't be running off to Asgard next? If I did, at least I'd be somewhere I could make a difference. Now that is crazy talk. That is the craziest of all possible talks. Why? Odin had the chance to kill me, but he didn't. He offered to teach me. Maybe if I had more answers, I could prevent- Prevent what? What is this about? It doesn't matter. Just let it go, okay? But you are gone for two days. With I love it. If Let's... you have business in other realms before speaking to your son, I'll join you. It's been so long since I could travel at will. Oh, she's already joined us, has she not? All right. You better screw his head back on. And I mean tightly. Nah, he's good. So you're back. Are you ready to answer me? About what? Where did you go? Who did you see? Was it Odin? What? Is that what you think? Do you deny it? Answer me! Did you go to Asgard? No! Of course not! But so what if I did? It's my future, it's my life! You are my son! Then why don't you trust me? If you want me to trust you, then tell me the truth! The truth is you're being a complete asshole! Laddie! You know that's no way to change a man's mind! He doesn't have any faith in me! It's fine if he keeps secrets, it's fine if Mom did! It is not fine! Her secrets are hard to reach step with this path! Yep. Oh, okay. So you don't believe in her anymore either? This is not about your mother. What you have done is lie. Wonder where I learned that. That's quite enough. Since when do you always take his side? Since he became the one making sense. Look, I was only thinking about going to Odin, but I swear it's for a good reason. There is no good reason to go to Odin. He'll only cloud your mind. But I'd be going for us. I gotta stop something bad from happening. Something bad did happen! Look at me! At Freya! At Tia! Odin did this to us! What's got everyone caterwauling all of a sudden? Atreus wants to go to Asgard. Asgard? You get kicked in the head or something? Great. I guess everybody's against me now. 
You must choose who you are going to be. Are you going to continue to lie and keep things from me? Or are you my son? Aw. Uh, choose? I never get to choose. Just leave me alone. Listen. Let go of me! Listen! I said let go! What the fuck? I can't! <laughs> it's Indri. Just, just, just try to keep control. Uh. Oh no. But he's he's just like, I'm just getting out of here. Come on! Boy! Oh. He's gonna find somebody who listens to him, right? Is sy sympathetic. He just is he home again here man i get it though but he needs to at least have a conversation with his dad he doesn't have to right. tell him everything oh it's been a while Freezing cold. lots of hellwalkers definitely in midgard i gotta remember how to play this you're just helping me stay warm there we go. A lot of the same kind of stuff. Oh. Yep. Oh, sweet hoe. Do her up truck. Trying to remember all my stuff here going. <laughs> Get out of here. <sighs> Gotta find some shelter. Okay. Little twirls. Got this. Got that. A little something something. <laughs> oh, what a game. And Odin is probably watching all this, right? And we're back in Midgard. Okay. These things? When did it get so bad out here? We're doing it. I just want to eat him. Let's eat him. You fool. Uh huh. Uh huh. Do somebody hear some crows? Something out here doesn't want to kill me. Oh, I love this. Come with me, son. We're about to get into it with uh, Odin. <gasps> Just need someplace warm. Then I can figure out where to go next. The runaway. Oh, Loki <gasps> finding his own path. I don't dislike this. Also, we have these other uh, arrows we can use anytime we need to. White uh, deflect runic arrows. Use R1 basic what arrows. What is this thing? Some kind of white? <laughs> yes. I. How do we do that? What are we doing? I swear, I just... What is it you want? I don't know. Because I can't figure out... This thing's just going to keep messing me up. I don't understand how you get away from it. Just eat him. Just I'll eat your ass. Just eat his ass. 
Uh, stun the wisp with orbs, R2 sigil, sonic arrows. Okay. New bestiary, white. That was that was seemed really uh, tough to fight them. Furious, sentient magic, united by a singular purpose, the destruction of life. A natural defense response, considering life has given way to Ragnarok. A white is created when a group of three wisps converge into one whole angry creature. If we come across three wisps as they are converging, it is quite possible to disrupt the process. No need to add how strongly I recommend doing so, but every little nudge helps. We had no choice there, though, right? Let's go, kid. Where? More ravens. You trying to tell me something? Yes. Now, there are... I can't remember... Ooh. I can't remember all the mythology. There we go. Um... Regarding Loki and Ragnarok and Odin, and I don't want to. I purposely not refreshed my knowledge on a lot of it. Um, I think I watched something before I played the first game, but I have because it's all convoluted and they're playing with different realms and different uh, mythologies mixed in. I just don't want to don't want to ruin myself. So I'm interested to see how this all plays out, though. Here's our way. First, he thinks I've been to Asgard. Then, lying. Ah! I'm trying to save your life, you big jerk! Oh. Gotta get out of the cold. Yeah! Need to kill wisps before they become whites. You gotta remember. Oh, there's that asshole. No, um, can't we? Do a rock truck. Oh, that wasn't what I wanted. Get out of here! Oh, I need to go get in on some of that, right? I don't want to face more of those whites if I don't have to. They are right. Um, I need to aim high. I'm just going to mess them up from here. Remember to lock on. Just go up and get him. Oh, what's up? What's up? Oh! More important to... More important to kill the whites, or the wisps, than anything else. Get out of here. Oh, I will toast you. Put some butter and jam on it. You don't. You don't want none. Not when we know how to just hit you with our shield. But this is about the kid being on his own right now and finding his own path. I love it. We oh, and we could have come around either way. Okay. Speaking of finding our own path. Anything else under here we need? No. I love this game. It's so good. I'm, it's people. I heard somebody talk about golden age of video games or something. Or we're we're always in. Like the, I'm playing amazing games right now every single day, and I have more just like lined up. It's so good. Let's uh. Oh. You know what? I've been I've been saving a little something. Lord. 
You want some? Dude, I don't think you do. Come here. I just started watching uh, Willow just came out, guys. The new series, and... Uh, get out of here. You're nothing. I find shelter, and then what? Where could I go? Where are you? I hear you, Odin. If I go to Asgard, following the prophecy where father ends up dead, but if I stay locked up at home, there's nothing I can do to stop it. I guess in Asgard, I could at least keep an eye on Odin. Be a spy. Find out his plan. Get control of this. I get what he's saying. Um, there is a sanctuary that he's been to, but what can he do there other than just sit and wait for things to happen? He wants to be proactive. He wants to try to change things. But, yeah, I mean, what's the role? Who wants Ragnarok? What's Ragnarok doing? It's Well, it's part of a cycle that can't be prevented. I don't think. It can be postponed. Oh, who am I kidding? I can't go to Asgard. Sorry, I throw in a save once in a while. Makes a little... These saves make sounds. But I think we got the, the dialogue in there. You're looking good, kid. By the way, let's just see here for a second. Do we have... Yeah, we have skills for him. What are we doing? Uh, let's make things more powerful. Hold R2 to shoot an even bigger barrage of runic arrows upon Melise. Oh, thank you. What is this? Hex potency caused by Atreus sigil arrows have an increased area of effect. Um, I haven't been using those as much. Headshots deal more damage. Heavy vertical attacks. Swing the bow for a wide attack. You know what? Um, let's do some of those. A thousand points. Heavy powerful attack finisher. You got to do R1, 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 and then R2, R2, R2. Four times and then three. That's still a little tough. Press R1 after... Harry, right before getting hit. Instinct, while grabbing an enemy. Uh, that's going to be with our guy there. Our, I'm just, what can we spend on? There we go. Buy as many as we can. Is that everything we can actually get? I feel good about it. Let's rock and roll. Wait, oh, hi. Are those red leaves? Freya's house. Oh my god. This is. This is the exact path that we were on before. The turtle. The toto. Sanctuary Grove. Is it dead? Is oh, it frozen? No. And we went up there and there were things we did and there was the garden back up and around in the well Charlie we Oh no No Charlie Please Please Charlie Oh mm. <laughs> Oh Hey big guy I'm here now. Don't you worry. I need to get you warm. You're gonna have to stand to let me into that house. Think you can do that? No, we can go down. Come on, Charlie. You have to do this. We go down the well. I... I can't... Help if you don't... Emily! Emily! Stand. Get up. Good. Good boy. What a mess. God, this game is so damn good. I got goosebumps. I know, buddy. I know. It's cold in here. What are we checking out here? 
I should close that window before snooping around. Which window? Man, so so beautiful. There we go. Is that the way it was? That's underground. Freya hasn't been checking on you. All right. Too busy hunting us down. Come on. Let's get you warmed up. Should be able to make a fire from all this mess. Or Charlie. Valkyrie armor? Does this go with the wings on the wall? From her friend? Wonder what happened to her. Is this Baldur's? Wonder how father was able to earn her forgiveness. I don't know if he did completely. Wow, it's beautiful. Never seen anything like this around here before. From around in Vanaheim? She must have really missed it. Is there anything else? All right, let's get a fire going. I can't oh, but... believe she never came back to check on her house. To check on you. That's not an excuse. Oh no. Are we tearing up a book to burn? What's wrong with you? There's other stuff here. Unless it was an empty blank page or something. Oh, Charlie. You're welcome. Where do I go now? I can't stay. Mm -hmm. I just can't let my dad die too. There's gotta be something I can do. But he doesn't know what's the right way, so maybe he shouldn't do anything. They discussed that earlier. The elves and the light elves and dark elves. Oh, pecking, pecking, pecking. Mm. It, it's okay, buddy. No, it's not. I think he's here for me. Yep. I'll be okay. I think. Here we go. No. Okay. I'm ready. Take me to him. Oh, wow. He is the All-Father. I know he's getting a bad rap in this, but he's good and evil. He's, he's everything, isn't he? I want to hear some real talk. <coughs> so beautiful. <coughs> we made it to Asgard. Should have learned to swim before Midgard froze over. Charlie, Freya must have been so obsessed with hunting us that she neglected her giant turtle house, her so-called friend. When I first saw Charlie out in the cold, I thought he might be dead. He's alive, but he's freezing out there alone. I lit a fire to keep him warm, but he's going to need 
someone to stay with him full time if he's going to survive much longer. You know, in all this, like, who are the good guys? Who are the bad guys? Like, who's, oh, you know, it's like, it's, are there, are there lines that are actually drawn? Or is, is it black and white? I think they're going to mess us up here now too. And we're going to start liking Odin and he's going to talk a lot of sense. That doesn't mean that he's not going to screw people or people we love aren't going to die. I just don't. Oh, it's so crazy. Oh my gosh. Hello. I'm here. Odin. Oh, so planes Bird. of I Ida. Is this Asgard? I just want to look here. Oh, we have the wolf on us. Oh, the walls. Ooh, this place is beautiful. Hey, wait up. Oh, that's no, that's not a whatever this is. It's beautiful. Not a sign of Fimble Winter. Let's go. The um. wall! This is Asgard! Hold on! I'm coming! Um... Why are there things we have to fight? Oh! You don't seem friendly. Nope. That's okay. What's coming? Oh. Let's kill the creatures of this land. Oh, why are we locked on? Because my butt, my thumb hit. You know what? Um. Let's get this guy. Can we kill hey, one? <laughs> I thought you said I was welcome in Asgard. What else we got? Where you at? I'm used to I'm hitting a square to try to get other people involved. How many more we got? Oh, there we go. Just do it. Oh, come on. Get you versus poison bastard. I just want to look around this place. Nice, we'll take it. It's beautiful here. Not a sign of Fimble Winter. I better keep heading towards the wall. It's beautiful here, but there's still these creatures everywhere, right? Let's look around. Oh. Oh. You think we're not going to check every nook and cranny? And we should be... Well, although experience is gained separately. Um, but I feel like since we're doing side quests, we should end up being overpowered in this game if we continue on that path. You could have led me around those. Yeah, but that's not the way things work. Lead you around. Oh! Yep! Oh my god. There we go. You punk ass. Oh, this is nice. I'm having fun. We're, this can't be too long. They're, gonna, they're not going to leave us on our own for too long, I think. We are headed in there. Ah, yes. Good old hack silver. 
Oh, we had been down there. Okay, okay. Just want to make... Oh. See? Oh. Oh, here we go. Oh, no. Yeah, danger. I know. Got it. I see him. Hit it. There, that's something. We know we had to hit those kind of things. Is that is that a spawn point? Is that what it is? You know what? Let's do it. Well, this might be the craziest thing I've ever done. But if that's what it takes to change Father's fate... I'm not sure if it will. Hey, Bird! Where'd you go? Hold on! I'm coming! Just gotta find a way through. We'll find it. Everything I came to Asgard for is on the other side of that wall. Or so you think. Don't put what all that weight in it. Odin? Uh, hi. I came to be your apprentice, I guess. But it doesn't mean I, like, serve you now. Adopted Not son. Foretold by prophecy kind of way. You know what? Let's try these. I don't know how to uh, do anything good with that, actually. I changed my mind. You know what? Animals. Get out of here. Okay, so we have these, but how do we blow them up? Oh. What are the... Oh, damn, these rune things. So does that mean there's a rune? Ick. A stone here are. somewhere? Go. No, we're getting back under the stun. Get out of here. Whew. Bet it's safe from the other side of that wall. Wait. How do I get past the wall? I never came up with a mere story about Hrimthur. The stonemason's son built a flaw into it. He only told Frey about it. And I didn't think to ask. Hold on. Why was Frey at the house? Did she move in with us? You, you know should have been asked. Focus, Loki. He's calling himself Loki now. He's adopting... Okay, we can't go over there. That name... I don't think. Okay, so those things, those rune, uh, it's freaking me I out. Keep moving my... forward. Get to the mm -hmm. wall and get through it somehow. Oh, ah, so good. All right, time to climb. I do see some fire, so we're gonna try to see if we can use our tool on that. <laughs> can we do a little puzzle time. <laughs> So, Helka. But then, what do I have that would flame? Ah! I don't. No. Oh, that's a little crazy. Yeah, how are we gonna? How do we get that? Hmm. I don't think I have. We don't have anything that's flaming, right? We're gonna have to come here with our with our guy. Let me think here for a sec. Yeah, I mean, unless we can throw down flame on something, I don't have flame. We don't have the. Yeah, I don't. I don't get it yet. So we're gonna move on. Even even though I'd love to have whatever's in there. 
Oh, hmm. there we go. Father would just burn this away with his blades. But what can I do? Get off her! Oh, I know huh. what we can do. Maybe that sigil magic on my bow can help. Oh, yeah, what maybe. If okay. I could just get that fire to spread to the bramble. <sighs> right. So we have three, so we need to... One, two, maybe the flame will hit. No way up from here. I better figure a way through that bramble. Alka! Oh, man. So, let's see. How do we get the angle of the dangle? Let me keep trying with this. We're going to get it. We're going to get it. Makes sense. Hmm. Gonna need a better angle on that fire. So we have to actually shoot the fire to get that, right? Alka! Did it. I heard it. Okay, okay, so we have to use environment. I was thinking we can also pick up things and throw them if we get a chance, but... Bow ability. Atreus fires a seeking sigil arrow that ricochets between enemies. Is that something... What do we have? Sharp shooting stare. Why don't we go... That's damage versus runic stun. But that just gets them all going. You know, for now, we're going to leave what we have on here till I understand how to use that better. So I don't know how to kind of get that. Um, Once again, here, let's see. Can we... There we go. And, and, and... One here. No, yes. And, got it. No. Oh, we get you, man. It's just like... Why isn't... I don't get it. L2, R2 to link transfers to single fame. Flame? <laughs> there we go. Okay, okay. Still seems a little, little off. I'm not quite getting it the way I want to yet, but that's okay. Anything else back this way I'm missing? No. Let's push forward. Wait. That sounds like people. Good people. Bad people. A camp. Is Asgard closed? You need help? You, uh, you look a little lost. Oh, uh, I'm just getting my bangs. Well, there's nothing to see this way except the big wall. Is there a gate to go through? <sighs> nope. Not unless you're an Aesir god, but I guess you'd know that if you were an Aesir god. Well... Me? No. I'm from Midgard. What? No shit! Me too! I'm Skildir. Lucky. Skildir. Hang on. Are you... all from Midgard? <laughs> yep. The, uh... Allfather saved us from the desolation. Gave us a safe place to settle, but... We don't go in there. Can't get into the city unless you know magic. Do you... You don't know magic, do you? A little bit, yeah. What? No shit. Ah. Can you walk through walls? Not yet. Ah. Couldn't I just climb over it? <laughs> that? Without any gear? Uh, no. Aren't you afraid of dying? Well, yeah. I mean, look at that. But... Oh no wait. Wait, you know the Allfather? I'm sort of his apprentice. No shit! What is he teaching you? I'm not Nothing sure. Nothing yet. Well, how many other students? I don't know. How long are you stay? No idea. You don't know. Okay. Oh, there's the gate. 
I'm gonna go climb that wall now. Well, this I gotta see. You need help? I appreciate it, but I gotta go alone. Oh, I wasn't gonna climb with you. I may owe Odin my life, but I don't owe him my death. Not that I think you're gonna fall. Forget I said anything. <laughs> so cool. I mean, is that Hugin? Is Hugin your guide? Who? Odin's raven. You know, from Hugin and. We got to find out this. Hugin and Munin. These two aren't like the spies we see around the realms. Hugin and Munin are Odin's own weird magical pets. Back at the house, I saw them disappear into his tattoos. Mimir told me once how they came to be that way. How they were normal ravens once until Odin captured their whole unkindness. Most of them he roasted and ate for supper, gross. But on Hugin and Munin, he experimented, wiping their memories and binding them to his will. Mimir also referred to them as right pricks, even for birds. Sounds like Mimir. Munin is a pretty good guy, though not sure he'll know too much about climbing. Fair point. Awesome. All right, well, let's climb this uh, wall and let's do it in the next episode.